If you see what we can see, then adventure it's for all of us. There's a place that we should be. Come along, come along, cause it's high time we can lose. Come and draft away with us. It's just like there's so much to do. And you don't know where to start for the best. It's like a puzzle. It is like a puzzle. So we decided to change two frames, which are going to be scarfed, which don't go to the keel. So the ones we've selected, I couldn't find my safety orange paint. Don't know where that's gone. Um, the ones we've selected, so we're using black. So we're going to replace this frame and this frame to about near here maybe. No, here, sorry, here, 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 and here. So then they're gonna go right up there. And then, because we're scarfing them, they'll be long enough. Because then we didn't buy wood long enough. You could have got a bigger tree, couldn't you? As a woman, you know, you would always want bigger, but you've got to settle for what you've got. <laughs> so for this job, we're using our angry grinder attachment. Oh. Amazing. But it cuts straight through the copper. So we don't have to drill the heads off or anything like that. So I've made two holes. So we're taking this frame out and this frame out. So I've just tried to split it with the hammer and the chisel and it's solid, absolutely solid. Want to see what's for dinner today? This is Amelia's favourite, isn't it? Yeah. Sauce rolls. Ooh. I think they might be done. What are you doing, Mills? I'm reading a magazine. Oh, on what? On Readly. On Readly. Wow. So Readly is sponsoring today's episode. Readly is a app on your phone or your tablet for magazines and newspapers. There is loads of magazines to choose from, loads of, from kids to boating magazines. Yes. I read a few. I know, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but what's really good about it as well is that you can have five family members on it. Yeah. So I've got it on my phone, amelia has got it, I've Simon's got it. got it, and Mason's, Mason's got it on his well. phone and his tablet. It's really good how it's laid out as well, isn't it? It is, and do you know what you can also do? You can search by keywords. So okay. if there's something that you want to read about, uh, but you, you don't do... know what magazine it's in, you can search the keywords. You did that the other day, didn't you? You, you, um, you put a ship happens into it, and then it brought <laughs> loads of like magazine. Yeah, but I also then put about like when we were doing the sea cocks yeah. and the skin fittings, you search keywords yeah. and it brings up relevant articles, which is really good. You know, another thing that's good at, you can download it and read it offline so you can read that magazine offline so if you're which amelia does it in the car in the car or if you ever go on a flight if they ever reopen again but you know what the best thing about it is if people stopped buying actual newspapers and uh, magazines it just saves the planet it just saves the planet you're right i'd highly recommend it and also if you click the link in the description you get a six week free trial and yeah. after the six week free trial it's 7.99 a month and what's also really good is usually amelia will sit there watching youtube but mm. now she's actually sitting there and she's doing more reading yeah. which is fantastic you can even read on readly while you're making a brew and while you're waiting for your paint to dry and while you're driving your boat 
And while you're lying on the beach. And while you're going down a ladder. And while your boat's sinking. <laughs> and lying in bed. And when you're on the toilet. So I'm just going to whack some primer on all the frames. Day. Almost your birthday. Hold on a minute. When this video comes out on Friday, it's Amelia's birthday today. What? This video will come out on Friday. Oh. And that's when your birthday is. So yeah, we should sing happy birthday to you now, won't we? <laughs> Very kind couple called Peter and Mary have just been down to see us. Do you want to see what they brought us? It's very heavy. A bell. Feel how heavy it is? It's heavy that, it's solid isn't it? So, do you want a ringer? How do I do that? Hold it, <laughs> shake it. <laughs> Ready? <laughs> How loud is that? That's loud. So that is our new ship's bell. It needs to clean them. Who's going to polish these up for us? So did I have the tea bell? <laughs> the tea bell. <laughs> so this needs polishing. Not so heavy. Yeah. I can't hold it for long. Yeah, this is polishing, okay? Oh. Yeah. And should we should we get Sarinda engraved on it? Yes, hundred percent. Have you rung the bell yet? No. Can I ring it? Yeah, go on, Mas. I need some ear defenders. Listen to the ring. I know. That's proper material, there. Yeah. So yeah. we're gonna take that back. Take it off a look. What's that? Oh, a measuring thing. Oh. Temperature. Thermometer. <laughs> it measures my height on a. Um... So it's twenty-one degrees at the moment. It's warmer. How cool is that? So we're gonna take these all back and clean them all up. Amelia's gonna clean them up. Yes. So Peter said, if you're if you're responsible for cleaning it all up, then you can be the keeper of the bell, and you're the only one who's allowed to ring it. Oh, that's pretty cool. That. That's really cool. The keeper of the bell. Yeah. Work faster! Ow! <laughs> Is it heavy? No, it's hot. <laughs> ah, even the wood's hot! <laughs> Hi! Where are we at? Just sanding my boat. <laughs> Try this one instead now. <laughs> to hoover it up and paint your boat! <laughs> now let's wait for the paint to dry. So I'm just going to prime the scarf joints and so unthickened epoxy. Then it'll soak into the end grain, won't it? So just putting the epoxy on the um on the end grains. Look at the grains in there. Bear in mind all this wood. This wood is 80 odd oh yeah, because well, you know, 78, 80, 79. She was, she was assembled, wasn't she, in yeah. 1943, so 
Beautiful. So we're gonna to have to go and do the same on the other one and give it a good just in case it sort of wicks into the um and while, yeah. while this is all going off, then should we set up for the copper? Copper! Look! You're filming, us filming! Hi! <laughs> Behind the scenes! <laughs> yeah. I'm gonna start setting up for doing copper nails. We've made more rope tools, as you've seen in the it might be a previous video. I might make yeah, in the previous I'm doing a video whether it's before this or no it will I think it will be before this of tools that we've made I'm weight testing on the wood as well I don't know if I'm gonna get time to do that before this one it's there somewhere and if it's not it will be soon Welcome back to Fun With Your Poxy. Aw, oh, not fun with grinders no more. I've been doing grinding, bored of grinding. <laughs> what are you doing? Well, I don't know. <laughs> you know what you're doing? You just give me some epoxy and I've never done this before. What, put glue on something? Well, shut up. <laughs> so do you, do you just put it on this side? Yeah, just give it. <coughs> I'll tell you what, just attempt to put some under there, but you're never going to get it under, are you? So bear in mind, we've already pre... Pre epoxy this, haven't we? Well, can I put it on here first? As yeah, so, yeah. so how thick do you want it? Very. Just put. Well, I want all that on. Because basically, want... it just squeezes out. Do you want all? Is this for both of them? Yes, yeah, both of them. Okay. Yeah. Um... Harder. 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 Yeah. Yeah. Keep going. Okay, keep going. One more. Half. Yeah. That's it. I can't remember what the YouTube channel says, but they say like, smoosh it in. Smoosh it in. It could be Mads from Sail Life, or... I don't think Jordy uses um, epoxy. He does it properly. Obviously, we are going to be putting copper through as well, aren't we, Jim? Yeah. So it's going to be double, double fixed. Um. Peanuts. Just stop filming now. I'm trying to like make it pretty. So it's a little bit breezy, so you might be getting a bit of wind noise, but I do apologise. Hey, it's a shame the painting party wasn't this weekend. It's been actually very, very nice. I sort of thank everybody. Everybody was amazing. It was, it was such, it was a laugh. You know? Me and Jimmy didn't actually do much because we were sort of like running around trying to do this, do that, do this. But it was outstanding. So thank you ever so much, and I hope to see you next time. Last time, we had to come through with a smaller long drill bit and then go back through the other way, swap the drill bits over and go through. But because we didn't have a long enough drill bit basic, basically. But we found these, and I got the inspiration for these off Travels with Geordie. Um, basically an aircraft bit, but they're 12 inches long. Because by the time we go through the hull and then through the frame, through the stringer, and then through the web frame as well, but we can get all a nice, a nice bored hole now. So... Okay, so you probably saw this. Did you see this? Oh, we didn't weigh it though, did we? But we weighed it off camera. What was it five kilos? So just hold it as normal. So it's quite heavy. Yeah. So we put it on some elastic. How many times is that going to swing and hit me in the shin today? So you got to like go in. It's like so you can hold it against there though. Yeah. And then obviously when you get up there, you might have to just lift it a little bit or. And then, you can't it. see because the sun's, the sun of it? Oh. You can change the height of it. Yeah? All good. All good stuff. 
So what's going to happen now then? You're going to go inside. We're going to put the roofs on them all and get them all. So if the roofs are on with the nails sticking out, we're going to do all of them. And then we're going to cut them all at once. And then we're going to do all the peeling over. So we're not picking tools up and putting tools down. Production line, copper roof line. <laughs> Full of silicon now, but that was another homemade tool that we made to uh, just to you know bed the uh, copper nails in because obviously the hammer can't poke it in. So, oh, that hammer's way easier. <laughs> yeah, that's well better than the lump hammer. Set the camera off. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Hello. Your hair's not annoying today, is it? Um. <laughs> so it's it's quarter to nine, and we've put two frames in. Yeah. We've put all the nails in and the roves on, but we haven't peened them over, no. and we're quite worried now that it's too late, it's too late to yeah. keep banging because we have got neighbours and it does and make a hell of a rocket, It does make a noise and. We don't realise how noisy it is, but it does echo a lot here, so we don't want to upset the neighbours. So we're going to call it a day yeah. at this because they're all watertight, they're all on, they just need peeing and they're over. They're not coming out. They're not coming <laughs> out. <laughs> yeah. So we'll show you what we've done inside, so you can see from the inside. Mm. And then it's like, you know, past nine. You've been here since yesterday. Four o'clock yesterday. <laughs> so, and he didn't, <laughs> didn't start work until like 10 last no, night. I'm not, I'm not. I don't like work too much. <laughs> it's, it's long days, isn't it? Long days, yeah. So, at least we've managed to do nearly two today. Yeah. You know, we've done one last time. Maybe poxy in. And, and, a and a stringer. And a stringer. Yeah. So, could, we're picking up pace from the first frame we did because it yeah. took us a day just to do one frame one, last time. Yeah, so, we've yeah. done two frames and a stringer. Yeah. So, yeah, so, come and see what it looks like from the inside. See that hole up there with the flowers? Yeah. Fell through it before. Did you? <laughs> yeah. It's actually, you have to mix it quite well. <laughs> <laughs> Do you? You don't know that? No. Well, mix it or just unmix. Oh. <laughs> well, if I go anti that it'll unmix. <gasps> Did you know that? <laughs> Gemma's, Gemma's looking at me like. He could be saying something truthful. <laughs> I know he's taking the mic, don't worry. <laughs> it's taken me forever to correct our subtitles because not even Google, not Google, YouTube subtitles can't even understand us. So, me or you? Uh, you mumble and it just makes up random words for me. <laughs> you just make random words up there. <laughs> Do you know it smells like peanuts? <laughs> You can also read readly when you're sniffing glue. <laughs> Can't say that. <laughs> say something good. Say something intelligent. It's me talking to. <laughs> right, can we go and clip <laughs> this? <laughs> so, mm. so, please describe us in your own words. Sneep. <laughs> <laughs> they're, my, they're my own words. <laughs> this is how we do our own drone shots. <laughs> You're the big stick. <laughs> drone shot! 